Well, the dire situation in Syria has prompted many to flee the country, but tragically not always to safety. Four of those, amongst 30 migrants who died when a boat sank off the Italian island of Lampedusa on Friday, came from the Muadamir suburb. Today, Channel 4 News has learned more about the circumstances surrounding the vessel's sinking. According to survivors, the Libyan Navy fired at the ship's hull, prompting a panic on board, which capsized the vessel. Porrick O'Brien reports. The fourth line that separates the third world and the first runs right through the waters around the tiny island of Lampedusa. Another rescue just yesterday. The latest installment in the staggered flotilla trying to get to Europe. October always the busiest month before winter and rough seas. Earlier this month over 300 died. On Friday over 30. The tragedies are running into each other. Today, new details emerged about Friday's incident. We managed to speak to a survivor on board. He told us a Libyan military vessel shot holes in the hull of the boat as the traffickers tried to escape. We were followed by a military boat with Libyan flag. They followed us for an hour. Then they asked the captain to stop and then started to shoot in the air. They were trying to turn the boat upside down. Then they started to shoot at the boat. They shot at the engine. They managed to hit four people as well. The UNHCR's man on the ground in Lampedusa takes up the story. Because of the oil caused by the, the, the shooting, basically the water was started entering into the boat and causing... Uh, uh, a lot of tension among among the, the Syrians that were uh, on board, and at certain point, basically, the one that they were under the boat, uh, around 100 people, uh, were obliged to 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 go upstairs, uh, creating this unbalancing, and then at the end, finally, caused the 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 the, the, the capsize. We weren't able to put this to Libyan authorities today, but the Maltese Prime Minister met his Libyan counterpart, and he did. He undertook. Uh a pledge to investigate, to launch a public investigation on, on, on these allegations. The Syrian conflict drove them to Libya. The Libyans investigate whether their military shot at them. Their boat capsized with tragic consequences. The domino effect of global conflict washing up onto Europe's shores.